Hey guys, we are in Layton, Utah, and I feel like I'm in a movie with a fan. This wind is, it, it feels amazing because of how hot it is. Oh yeah. Uh, anyway, we are in Layton, Utah. Location, location, location on this house. So we are really close to Hill Air Force Base, shopping, freeway access, uh, everything is out here. We are super excited to show you this house. The plumbing has been updated. It's been completely remodeled. What do you guys think about the black and white? I, I dig it. it. Yeah, it's super fun. If you were to pull this house up on Google Maps, I am really struggling with my hair. <laughs> if you were to pull it up on Google Maps, you would see the original brick to this home. It was built in the 60s. Um, we've got the seven, seven bedrooms, four bathrooms, I believe, on this oh, wow. home. Uh, let's take a look inside. what you think about the black and the white in the comments down below. I know it can be kind of polarizing. And if you notice, it is a matte black. I like that it's a matte black. We do have a request for booties or removing our shoes. Oh, I always opt to remove my shoes. Me too. So tip for out when you're out showing homes or seeing homes. Wear shoes that slip on and off very easily. Oh yeah. You know what's interesting is I feel like I've been in this house before, but I don't necessarily think that I have. I think it's just the finishes. It's the clean canvas feel in here. Mm -hmm. Cause you've got the neutral tones with some white. And I love that they've whitewashed this. Cause yes. it was probably the brown and black really dated looking rock mm -hmm. that was here. And so it's fun that they've whitewashed it. Sometimes it's fun. I guess this is painted white when they mm -hmm. whitewash it, so you can still kind of see some of the color. That's super fun. Oh, we have a little hidden pantry back here. Oh, handy. Oh, and they have drawers. Oh, nice. That is perfect for like your entertaining linens. So like your tablecloths, napkins, those kinds of things. something on this side? No. So it's closed <laughs> off. Hmm. But originally there is, oh, there's like a hidden area back here. Anyway, <laughs> getting a little distracted. You know what? Let's see this light fixture. Super fun. Yeah. I oh, like geez. that they kept one that is close to the ceiling so that yes. you're not going to run into it when you when you're decorating. That's why I house. opt for the can lights too mm -hmm. in a dining area because then you can do any shape or size and you don't have to worry about how your chandelier is. Mm -hmm. So you've got granite countertops. These are probably not, yeah, they're not the original cabinets, but they are painted over for that white feeling. I'd say they're probably updated in the 80s, 90s, the 90s. 90s, yep. Mm -hmm. You guys ready for some s'mores? <laughs> how fun. They're even soft. That's kind of random to have in a vacant home. Listen, I just bought marshmallows yesterday and decided that I prefer them a little bit stale. I was like, these are That's too awesome. soft. They're too, too fresh. <laughs> Jesse, do you prefer handles or no handles? Oh, handles. I'm a big handles person. I feel like dirty hands too. Oh, always. Yeah. Yep. Always. Always smudging it if you don't have handles. You've got the granite backsplash, which is easy to clean. Oh yeah. You've got new windows here. Mm -hmm. um, throughout, I believe in the basement, they've installed bigger windows so you have more light. Oh, that's nice. Mm. Oh, I was hoping that the light would turn on. <laughs> <laughs> okay, oh, it, so that is one little negative. You do just have this. The one. This, yeah, one boob light of <laughs> in this hallway. But You've got some built-ins. Here's your original cabinet color that was probably in the kitchen. <laughs> See if they're sticky. Oh, not too bad. Oh. Not too bad. No, not bad at all. So here you've got your first bathroom fully updated with tile. Here's me. <laughs> oh, nice. This looks like a nearly brand new, might be brand new solid surface surround. Which is so nice, easy maintenance. Mm -hmm. Look at all the shelves. You have six shelves on that one. Hey, where'd you go? Oh, just in your second closet of your master. <laughs> <laughs> so this is actually over the stairs. That's why you've got the, the two shelves here. Gotcha. Usually there's an attic access in those, I feel like, so I'm kind of surprised yeah. that there isn't. And it's not in this closet. Hmm. So this would be your master bedroom. And then you've got 
Similar surround in here, updated bathroom. Nice, very nice. Yeah, it looks like all of the uh, vanities have been updated. I was hoping it was one of the ones where you can open it and you oh, yeah. store stuff in there. Mm -hmm. But you do have a window in there, which is nice. The carpet is a little older, but it's in good shape. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Still got a little squish to it as well. Here's your first bedroom. Do you oh, know what this is? Does anyone yes. know what this is? <laughs> it even has the actual ironing board in here. Oh, I love it. And then it's got like the pant leg or arm. Yeah, you can <laughs> hold it. This is awesome. I need one of those in my house. Yes. Do you iron? I think I we've do. talked about it before. Yep. You do. Yep. Yep, and Kaylee never irons. I own an iron for my Cricut press. <laughs> That's nice. So this would be a fan. good craft room. Looks like all the fans are updated too. Yeah. And this is a giant bedroom. Oh, I giant. think it mirrors the size of the master. You just don't have the bathroom in this one. Yeah. This is how where many the chirpers yep. at. Yep, found the <laughs> chirper. How many houses do we go in and they always have chirpers? Uh, so many. I it, feel like especially when they're vacant because mm -hmm. no one's here and doesn't drive anyone crazy. I think. I, my guess is the moving of all of the stuff out of the house, dust collects on the, on them and huh. then they tend to chirp easier. Yeah. It's my guess. I could be totally wrong. Got your garage. Oh, yeah. So this would have been an addition. Um, and you can actually see in here, they kept the original like storage shed that would have been in the carport. Yeah. I like that they even went the extra mile and did paint the, this probably wasn't painted before either. Yeah. And they brought the black doors in here too. Mm -hmm. We'll come back outside. <laughs> I find it interesting that we've got like the 70s carpet right here. <laughs> they finished the, refinished the walls but didn't refinish the yeah. carpet. But it's probably because it's thing. in like remarkably good condition. It is. It's just yeah. weird to me. But <laughs> it's stairs. It's not too bad. Very true. Take a look at that texture on the ceiling. It's kind of fun. Oh wow. I wonder if it was a self done ceiling. But it's but it looks good. Yeah. yeah. But I think I do agree. I do question mm -hmm. that as well. You have a plug up here too for TV <laughs> walk. I think so. I like that having that hidden back. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. It's very bright in here. Very. This laundry room is awesome. This is really nice. Oh, it's yeah. fully finished in here. You've got. Your cabinet here with the butcher block. Yeah, and tile. They put mm -hmm. nice tile in the, on the floor. I don't think it's tile. No? You think no. it's a vinyl? Yeah. Lay down vinyl. Oh, okay. You can hear it. Yeah. <laughs> You've got your rod there and your water shutoffs. Very handy. Accessible. Storage space. It's a mini door. I'm almost as tall as it. <laughs> so this is access to double water heaters and your furnace. Oh, heck yeah. Never mm. run out of hot water. Yep. Which is awesome. Mm -hmm. So here's another little master suite. So you could have oh. this where you rented it out. Um, mm -hmm. Be a little interesting. You'd probably want to know them because you've just got the, the access from the garage. Yes. But it is an option. This is a, an option for house hacking is where you buy it and then you rent it out to someone that you know and they pay off your mortgage. Mm -hmm. Makes it a little bit easier to afford. Yeah. Okay. I love that they picked surrounds that have all the shelving. And Jesse, look, there's a light in the tub. Yes, that is my, that's my favorite. Must have. Very light smart. Is that on tub. separate lights? No, oh, it's on the same one, but still, <laughs> mm -hmm. you can see while you're showering. Yes. And they also have a light in the closet. <laughs> that is, it almost looks like a cute little bench in there. Yeah, oh, it was probably like a reading nook. Oh. Maybe. I don't know, bean bag and some books there. Yeah. Handy to have. Yeah, I like it. Mm -hmm. Another bathroom. Oh my gosh. And I like that they've matched all of the, like you said, the surrounds oh, and yeah. then the the cabinets are all similar to cabinets. Cabinets and the mirrors. Oh, it's a little loose. It's crooked. <laughs> now, one thing that does bother me just a little bit is the plumbing plastered over, but I'm sure that was done way back in the day and has been that way for many, many years. That and just aesthetically it looks good, but yeah. 
Because the other, otherwise you would have to drop down the ceiling and then you'd lose some space in there. Oh yeah. Nobody likes to lose ceiling space. No. Definitely not, especially when you're in a basement. Ha, <laughs> ah, there's the light. Is this another bedroom or another bathroom or? Um, office? Oh, okay. This one's interesting. They've got fun carpet in here. Oh my gosh. That is fun. Yeah. <laughs> Little different, but it's cute. And they've got the matching mm -hmm. shelves here too with a light in the closet. New windows. Yeah. This is actually not a bad sized bedroom for a kid. A kid or I just think like an office. Yeah. So it's pretty hidden because it's in the back corner and mm -hmm. yeah. Oh well, yeah. It smells good in here too. It does. <laughs> Maybe they sold Scentsies or something and that's Maybe. where they stored them. <laughs> and you've got the floor that matches. It's all hard surface down here. It is different in each room. I think these two rooms match. Um, yeah, and then the other two rooms match. Yep. Mm -hmm. So that is seven bedrooms if you're counting that other space as a bedroom. Mm -hmm. That's awesome. That's so many bedrooms. It's a lot of space. Oh yeah. It's so clean in here too, which is mm -hmm. really nice. Sometimes you go into remodeled homes and you're like, eh, okay, like you're still mid remodel, but it's really clean. Everything's complete. Yeah. All their paint lines are, are well done. You don't have what we call renter specials. Yeah. <laughs> With it is two-tone paint. paint too, right? Or is yeah. that one? No, two? it's two. I think it it's is two. two. Yep. yep. Yeah. And two-tone paint is when the wall and ceiling are the same color and then the baseboards are another. Okay. Three-tone is when the ceiling is, typically it matches whatever color you did the baseboard. Just a different sheen. Yep. Okay, let's take you outside. Here we are back out in the garage and give you a little sneak peek of the original carport shed. Oh, nice. It's really nice. Yeah. The paint and everything smells very fresh out here. They even painted the back side of the door. Oh, I love that. Which is so nice. Oh. <laughs> I think it was closed before. Oh, yeah. Got it. <laughs> Fidgety kick plate. Well, it's not a kick plate. What do they call that when it's on a door? I can't even remember. Yeah. Latch plate. plate. Latch plate, yeah. Oh, okay, this, this is plate. awesome. <laughs> this is awesome. A little reading nug, drink your coffee out here, relax oh, in the yeah. evening. It's perfect. And it actually has soft, uh, I can't remember which one's the soffit and which one's the fascia. Soffit. This yep. is soffit. Yep. <laughs> it's actually finished out. So much green space to run around. Ooh, and the grass is soft. Ooh, it looks soft. You've got RV parking on this side. Which is really nice. Oh yeah. Fully fenced yard. Yeah. Unless you have a jumper That's or true. a climber. And you might need to get a taller <laughs> fence, but it is fully fenced. Yeah. If you got a little dog that doesn't jump that high. <laughs> there you have it. So Jesse. Yeah, Kaylee. Four bedrooms. Nope. Seven bedrooms, Seven bedrooms, four bathrooms. Yes. Uh just over twenty three hundred square feet. What do you think the listing price is on this one? Um, with that many bedrooms and the great yard. Garage too. Oh yeah. In in. And it has, uh, oh, those skylights in the garage. Those yes. are cool. We didn't even really showcase that. Nope. Um, I'm going to say right, I'm going to say over 500,000. We'll sit at 500,000. Oh, so okay. a really good price for the square footage and location of this yeah. one for sure. Yeah. Love it. It's close. It really is close to everything. Like you said before. Mm -hmm. Hill Air Force Base, shopping, mm -hmm. the mall, tons of restaurants out here, um, and our office. You can come yeah. say hi to us. <laughs> <laughs> Very true. <laughs> I feel a little off. We're recording inside the house since yeah. it was so windy outside. Yeah, we'd be blown away. Yeah, it was awesome. <laughs> anyway, I'm Kaylee. And I'm Jesse. We are the Key Utah Realtors. The key to your real estate success here in Utah with KW Success. Don't forget to like and subscribe mm -hmm. for other home tips and home tours. Mm -hmm. See you there.